things I got on the counter that you guys can So especially because and, you and were... It's, and it's wow. compared to everything else. Nice. Oh my God. And then <laughs> the idea of the mayor's walk is every Monday for our community to be together and be a healthy city. We start off our, our week on a Monday and we go out and we walk together, we meet our friends, we do this and we look forward to the week and we get healthy. It's the best way to be part of our city. Next Sunday, we're having our big celebration on Rodeo Drive because of why we're standing here right now. So Kimberly, take it away. This monument was erected in 59 and it pays tribute to the stars in our city that fought against the annexation of our city to Los Angeles. And depicted here we have Tom Mix, Corinne Griffiths, Mary Pickford, Douglas Fairbanks, and, uh, and Will Rogers, our, our first honorary mayor. And the city wanted to basically sell away our city to Los Angeles because either for a lack of water or because our water was so stinky, it smelled very sulfuric. Again, uh, they couldn't vote to, to annex the city. Incredible moment right now for me to be in front of the Roxbury Park Community Center. Our community for years have been talking about it. We finally did it. A unanimous vote from our council <laughs> to make this happen with our Parks and Rec Commission, our community that came out to make this vision. And you are all here today seeing it first. Yay! Yay! which you need to be at is on June 8th, but we're here today to see it first, and it's so exciting. We walked here because we're a healthy city. Yeah. I want to introduce you to Nancy Hunt Coffee, yeah. who has been such an incredible leader, has helped make this happen, and she's going to tell us how this is all going to work. This is my fantastic boss. And uh, so we're opening on June 8th. We're opening on June 8th, which is our uh, big celebration. We'll be having uh, family fun and games, tours of the building, concerts, all kinds of wonderful things. I have doggies in, inside the community center. I'm sorry. I'm evil. It's okay. Everyone's attention. Thank you. So this is intended to be an indoor-outdoor space where you can be in the building but appreciate the outside and vice versa. So foldable wall was an accent that the council themselves added so that the, the door could be open completely and people could enjoy the outdoors as well as the skylights. Council directed those to be put in. The materials that are here are materials that you'll see out in the park or the same kind of palette, you know, color. So, um, and this was intended to replace the courtyard, many of you may remember, that was in the center of the uh, previous community center. So this area will probably be set up on a daily basis at a minimum for our senior nutrition program. Now, as part of the renovation of the building, uh, we needed to put in a new kitchen, of course, to serve the senior nutrition program. Uh, Beverly Hills residents can rent. They uh, get a discounted rate. Non-residents have to pay more. Since we do have cooking classes up at Greystone right now, and so we've been talking about, you know, expanding those down here. As well. So let's go to the kitchen.